my body is your sanctuary my body my body oh is your sanctuary purify me purify me as gold so i may be bold to say my body is your sanctuary my body my body jesus is your sanctuary my body my body my father is your sanctuary purify me god purify me as gold so I might be bold to say my body is your sanctuary. Welcome viewer once again, my viewers. I want to welcome you to all you need is the word with Pastor Abraham Moses. It shall be well with you. It shall be well with your family. The almighty God will make way for you. And the Lord will supply your need. The Bible says the Lord shall supply my needs according to his riches in glory. God will make way for you in the name of Jesus Christ. I'll be talking on hold on to your dream. Hear me, hear me. Remember the dream you had when you were much younger. Remember the dream you had about your future, about your family, about the business empire, about the ministry. Hold on to it. My text shall be taken from Genesis 37 verse 5. And Joseph dreamed a dream, and he told it to his brethren, and they hated him yet the more. Hear me? I'm taking that place again, Genesis 37 verse 5. And Joseph dreamed a dream, and he told it to his brethren, and they hated him yet the more. People of God, mind who you share your dream with. There are people that are vision killer. Mind who you share your vision with. Joseph got himself into trouble when he showed his dream to his brethren. If he had known, he would have kept quiet. He was so excited about the dream, about the future, about the plan. And he told them. And the Bible says they hated him the more. Look at the five pieces of Joseph. It came from people, from his people, his own people, from people to pits, from pit to Potiphar, from Potiphar to prison, from prison he met Pharaoh, from Pharaoh he met Paul, he became the prime minister. God is going to elevate you, he's going to change your story, he's going to do something great in your life, in the name of Jesus Christ. But when you share your dream with the right people, you will get results. And the only thing that cancels insult is results. Hear me? Hold on to your dream. Mind who you share your dream with. When they draw a dog dream, the dog don't tell anybody the dream. The dog keep the dream in it, keep the dreams in his heart. The Bible says, out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. Hold on to your dream. What is that dream you have for yourself, for your wife, for your children, for your husband, for your future? Hold on to it. It shall be well with you. Let me pray for those who want to give their life to Christ. Wherever you are watching from, can you say, Lord Jesus, I know I am a sinner. I cannot help myself. Help me. Cleanse my name from the book of death. Write my name in the book of life. Thank you for doing it. In Jesus' name, amen. The prayer looks so simple. You just gave your life to Christ. You just gave your life to Christ. For prayer and counseling, give me a call. On plus two three four eight zero two eight three five 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 four eight. Let me pray for those who just gave their life to Christ. Father, help them not to go back to their sin. Forgive them their sin. Show them mercy. In the name of Jesus Christ. Once again, give me a call on plus two three four eight zero two eight three five 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 four eight. Follow me on. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Search for Abraham Moses Bishop on YouTube. By the right hand side, click on the red subscription bell to subscribe. It shall be well with you. Follow me on Instagram as well. Abraham Moses Bishop on Instagram. Follow me on Facebook. Abraham Moses Bishop. I have a page on Facebook as well. Abraham Moses Bishop. I have a group on Facebook. All you need is the one. Let me go back to the message. Hold on to your dream. That was what made, made David, made, made Joseph to go down. That was what made Joseph to go down. Hold on to your dream. Hold on to your dream. In Daniel chapter 2 verse 22, the Bible says, He revealed the deep and the secret in. He knoweth what is in the darkness, and the light dwelleth within. 
It is lack of maturity and irresponsibility to live on planet Earth without dream and aspiration. You must have a dream. What is the dream? The greatest challenge you will face in life will be against your dream. You need to hold on to your dream. Martin Luther King said, I have a dream. I have a dream. I see the poor. I see the poor and the rich coming together. I see the black and the white coming together. He had a dream and he held on to that dream. Praise God. May you not die before your time. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hear me? The poorest man is not the one without money. The poorest man is a man without dream. What is your dream? What is your goal? What is your aspiration? What is your plan for the next five years? What is your plan for the next two years? What is your plan for the next two months? You need to have a short plan and a long plan. Short-term plan and a long-term plan. You need to plan for yourself, plan for your life, plan for your future. Hold on to your dream. Hold on to your dream. And God will not put you to shame. In the name of Jesus Christ. Ecclesiastes chapter 5 verse 6, it says, verse 3. It says, for a dream cometh through the multitude of business. And a fool's voice is known by a multitude of words. You hear me? When you have a dream, you talk too much. Church, 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 you tell this and that. Before you know it, they act your dream. Just like the actors that act people's details on social media. When you begin to talk to people will act into your dream and they will kill your dream. Don't try to impress anyone. Rather, impart them. It shall be well with you. Please hold on to your dream. Hold on to your dream. Don't let your dream dry, die. It is well with you. Who told you you have failed? You have not. You have only discovered the way by which it cannot work. You will succeed in the name of Jesus. It is well with you. It is well with you. As I said earlier on, heaven is real and hell is real. Make up your mind not to go to hell. It is well with you. Hold on to your dream.